I mean, last year, obviously, at this point in time, this was kind of Madi's team, Zordich's team, Hill, going those guys. It's now your guys' team now. How different is that? Oh, it's a little bit different. Obviously, those guys are great leaders for us, but uh, you know, as everything else, time moves on, and uh, we're looking for other guys to take the leadership role. And I think that we got a lot of great leaders on our team that are looking to step up and um, take that take that role. What adjustment defensively? You know, having you know a new defensive coordinator, even though he's a guy you're familiar with. Um, Coach Butler is a great guy. We're, we're all familiar with him. He's a familiar face, and. Um, you know, he's, we're gonna. You know, we're not gonna change things up a whole ton, and um, you know, we're light years ahead of where we were last spring. So I think that uh, everyone's really excited as uh, Coach Butler, and I think he's a guy that everybody loves, and uh, a lot of guys want to play for. Him. I think the, the mood last spring was a little uncertain because obviously O'Brien was just starting out, and you know, all the stuff that had happened in the last year. How different is the mood and the atmosphere this year? We just think. Um, well, yeah, it was very different last year. Was, um, getting used to a whole new coaching staff, and there's a lot of different, um, you know, faces uh, all over the building. So um, it was a tough transition for us at first, but I mean, this year I think that our whole team's very comfortable with each other. We're very comfortable with the coaches, and um, you know, we're just ready to, to play football. And um, you know, a lot, a lot less distractions this year. Beyond the comfort level, how are you light years ahead of where you were as a team last year? Um, you know, just just the defensive schemes. Um, you know, we're, we're used to, to playing the, the same defensive schemes and stuff like that. So um, just getting the plays down, you know, especially the veterans that, that have been there before and have played them. And, you know, we have a bunch of games under our belt playing these defenses. So it's a much easier transition for us. You have guys, new guys on either side of you. How is the transition going for both of them? Hole obviously played a lot yeah. last year. Well, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't really say Hole's a really a new phase. I think he got a lot of playing time last year. And I think that he's, you know, one of the guys that, um, you know, even though he, he's a younger is looking to take on a leadership role. He's a great player for us. And um, Naeem got a little bit of playing time before he got hurt last year. I think that he's a good player and he's uh, ready to step up. What does Naeem kind of bring to the table? For, you know, we, we only saw him in a game or so. Uh, he, he's an athletic kid. Um, he, he knows how to play the game and uh, he's the kind of kid that can go in there. He's got some confidence. So, um, you know, he can definitely get the job done. Has the defense changed at all under John Butler? Or is it pretty much the same as he added? Um, the twist? Yeah, of course. There's little twists and twerks here and there and uh, he's put his own little spin on it. But, you know, generally I think he's trying to keep things um, pretty consistent. That way it's a, it's a lot easier for us. Those guys are have had playing time, don't have to make huge adjustments, and um, you feel really confident out there on the field. How about Bill? Has he changed much at all? Is he more of a comfort zone, do you think, given this is the second? Um, you know, I never saw Coach O'Brien being uneasy in any situation. I think the guy's a rock. He's a perfect uh, coach to have. Um, you know, under our circumstances, perfect guy to come in and to handle the job. So, um, Coach O'Brien never changes. You know what I mean? Like I said, he's a rock, and he's going to be the same coach. You know, from you know here and years on. How about the guys in, in front of you? You know, the defensive line replacing some faces there. What have you seen out of that group so far this spring? Uh, I'm seeing some great things. Um, you know, we do have some familiar faces: Daquan Jones, Deion Barnes. Uh, I think that they're really great players, and obviously we've seen that on the field. But also, we got some younger guys that are, can step in and um, you know do a good job with. Uh, you know, taking on, you know, whatever their new role may be. You know, we always talk about guys having a certain role. Some of the guys have a little bit um, bigger role to fill this year, and I'm pretty confident that we have guys that can do that.